Herschel, how do you feel about people that want to change America from when you and I were kids? I guess it's 80 to 90 or 70 to 80 million people in America that were born after 1990. We may have been bullied when we were kids, you know, in a class or teased and things like that, but not, not the type of culture that these kids have with the internet today. What do you say to those kids and those young people that are voting? Well, first of all, they don't know that the grass is not green on the other side, that they think they're somewhere better. And if they know another place is better than the United States of America, my thing is, why don't you go there or tell me, let me know who that is, because I can tell them right now that's not. I think our biggest problem is we've not shown our kids that most of the people today hadn't earned the right to change America. And that there are people that have died or not given their life up. There are people that have given their life up for this flag. They've given this life up that, for this national anthem. They've given their life up for our freedom and these liberties that we have in this country today. And we're taking it for, for, for granted. Well, I don't want that to happen. And I'm saying, and I'm not being tough, I'm saying, if you know a place better, you go there, but you lose your citizenship here in the United States of America. And then when you come back, you got to come back legally like we should be defending the border.